This is an excerpt of a recent Power Up webinar illustrating cool Photoshop tools to improve your still images. Hi, my name is Larry Jordan. In this excerpt, I'll show you how to use the Content Aware Patch Tool. This is Caliente, California, and uh, there's a railroad track going right behind me, which I'm not showing in this photograph, but it's the reason I'm standing on this hill next to this very lonely tree. It's beautiful. The wildflowers are out, except I've got this mess right here. It'd be nice if I could make that disappear. Well, there's a tool, one, two, three, four tools down. When you click and hold, normally it shows the spot healing brush, but I want to talk about the patch tool. The way the patch tool works is you just simply click and drag around the area that you want to fix. I'm selecting a region. Now, this is all hand-drawn. I could soften it if I wanted, but I'm not going to. I have the patch tool. Then click inside it and drag to a new area right around in here. There we go. And when you let go, ta-da, the new area replaces the old. Is that stunning or what? I mean, oh my goodness. Here's another example illustrating how to use the patch tool. The other thing that we could do is we could use the patch tool, which I didn't realize until I was practicing this last night, getting ready to talk to you today. Drag around the fabric with the patch tool. And then with the patch tool, just simply drag up. Make sure that your fabric folds a line and done. We can do the same thing with our bricks. Click with the patch tool. Yes, I could clone it, but notice I've got the lines and the bricks. Just drag so the lines of the bricks align. So it looks like they're all part of the same piece of paving. Done. The other thing I could do with the patch tool is, let's go back again. Step backward, okay. With the patch tool drawn, now let's feather this and dial in about a, a 14 pixel feather. Now that softens the edge, so when I drag it, I gotta line the bricks. I have a hard time remembering which way to move in that case. And now, because I've got the soft edge, it looks maybe more believable. This has been an excerpt of a recent Power Up webinar looking at cool Photoshop tools to improve our still images. For the complete version of this online training, please visit our store at LarryJordan.com slash store and look for Webinar 263. By the way, membership is a great value when you need to stretch your training dollars. Membership in our video training library saves you money and time. You can access all of our videos for a low monthly price of only $19.99. That's more than 1,900 movies, hundreds of hours on a wide variety of subjects. Plus, premium members can download practice media and projects. Our training covers Apple and Adobe software. We update it multiple times each month. And for more information, visit LarryJordan.com slash membership. And thanks.